You have seen this battle many times before. Rome told to war, several Spartans on one side of a bridge and another enemy on the other side of a bridge and it's always a slaughter. But this time I went to see, can the Spartans lose? And after doing a lot of like playing Rome told to war lately and for the last 10 years as well, I found out that war dogs actually do quite well against phalanxes and that's what they're up against today. Now, the actual units they should be able to kill, but sometimes the war dogs do get through the phalanxes and... Okay, maybe not here, maybe it will be a slaughter. Ah, oh, they're holding them back. Okay, the purpose of this video is meant to be trying to find a way to how to actually beat uh, the Spartans with a weak unit. Um, and I thought war dogs would be it. Maybe war dogs are it. I don't know. We might be able to break through if we can get enough dogs in here, they might be able to do it. See, so yeah, I'm trying to find a unit that can beat the Spartans, but yeah, this looks like it's going to be another slaughter video. <laughs> oh well, these are just as good. At least we're watching a lot of uh, a, a lot of good slaughtering happen. But the dogs might be able to make it. Are some of them swimming? <laughs> Yeah, I forgot dogs, uh, they can swim in Rome to a war, unlike, um, in Barbarian Invasion it's only units, but, um, yeah, dogs can do it in Rome to a war, which I find to be really weird. That needs to be in a, a weird things about Rome to a war episode. Ooh, but the dogs are actually making it through, the phalanx has collapsed. They're, they are getting actually around. They're starting to get some kills. Now we're going to win the battle itself, um, as in, you know, the Romans are going to break, but if the dogs can kill all the Spartans, then I guess that will be a victory to the Romans. It depends. Do we have enough dogs in the battle yet? Oh, some dogs have died. Ah, there's a victory. But still, some dogs have died all the way over here, because like, if Fiona dies, um, the dog dies. Sort of like uh, demons from the Golden Compass or something like that. Uh, each owner, I think, has two dogs. So if you can kill an owner, then you're able to kill uh, two different dogs, which makes it super easy. Where's that dog going? Nope, he's off. He's done. <laughs> he's not even swimming. He's just running up uh, into the water. He's not. He doesn't have a swimming mechanic. Well, the phalanx is broken. I could press space bar to lower the phalanx again, but I'm not going to. Just to let the dogs uh, finish it off. Hopefully the Romans don't retreat before the dogs are done. But I don't think we're going to get anywhere. Is anyone even killing anymore? Where are they going? Uh, some of the dogs are messing up. Ah, uh, this was not the battle I was hoping for. I was hoping for the Spartans to actually lose. Alright, let's, uh, yeah, let's lift the phalanxes, get them into battle. Uh, a bit closer, speed it up a bit. And let them slaughter the final remaining dogs. Yeah, the dogs are bugged. <laughs> this one's flying. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Look at those teeth for that. Alright, so yeah, lots of dead dogs, but they did quite well. Uh, they, they killed a lot of Spartans, but it just wasn't enough. Oh well, they broke the phalanx though, so war dogs with some actual swordsman units, war dogs break the phalanx and then uh, the actual swordsman can finish the phalanx off. That could work. Well, there's one more unit that I want to try today. Heroic victory, 452 kills, we lost... We only lost like 10, that wasn't much. Okay, so the war dog test was a little bit of a failure. It didn't go as planned, but there's one more unit that I wanted to try in this video. And will they be able to break 
the Spartan Phalanx. The Incendiary War Pigs. <laughs> so of course all these pigs were going to be set on fire and then launched into the Spartan Phalanx. I I don't think this is going to do it. The War Dogs, they could have done it. I think I was more confident in them, but the pigs, maybe not. I can't, I can't see them achieving victory. But let's see. Actually, they're probably going to get more friendly fire, if anything. That's what these pigs usually do. Right, so they're in the battle, and they've set on fire, and either done retreat into their own. <laughs> I think so. They're, yeah, they're retreating into their own. I was just going to start killing them, their own pigs. Oh, can the pig swim as well? Oh, that's adorable. <laughs> yeah, we got a pig swimming. Go, piggy! <laughs> oh, they drown. Oh, oh, they all drown. <laughs> the, the phalanx broke. <laughs> no, get back. Oh, whatever. All the pigs are killing themselves and all the other pigs. So, uh, yeah, this is not going as planned. I think the battle's already over. It's just friendly fire on the brute TI side. The balance of power actually favoured them more, but. Yeah, these pigs. <laughs> Once they're on fire, they're not done run towards the Spartans, they're done run back. Ah. Can you wear my stomach rumble? I want a ham sandwich now. <laughs> I'll go get myself a ham sandwich. <laughs> oh, those ones didn't even get the chance to get set on fire. <laughs> ah, that didn't go as planned. It's just a load of fried pigs on the battlefield. <laughs> Have we even... No, we haven't even... <clears throat> we haven't even lost one Spartan. Here we go, the final pigs are going to start dying soon. There we go. All dead now. And there's nothing the Brute I can do here. Well, actually, they have got a few kills. But... They're not going to get any more, I don't think. Actually, the, the normal soldiers are getting more kills than the pigs are, but that's because we're on an awkward angle. I don't know why the phalanx decided to move. What's he doing? Yeah, he's, some of them are stuck. There we go. Be free, Spartans, be free. <laughs> and we got the win. <laughs> Let's just get me out of here. <laughs> Of course, don't take today's video seriously at all. It was just a little bit of a laugh. I hope you enjoyed. If you have, please do like and share or subscribe to get notified of my next video. I've been Melkor. Goodbye.